Hey, how's it going guys? Jonathan Navarro here. Um, right now it's midnight. I am still in Fort Lauderdale. I'm going to have to drive my way, uh, drive all the way up to uh, Orlando, or I should say the Kissimmee, St. Cloud, whatever, Disney World. It's going to be uh, hopefully a three hour drive from here. Um, and uh, hopefully it's going to be smooth to get into the uh, Disney Hollywood Studios parking lot. Uh, but right for right now, uh, I'm going to head out and I'll see you guys in a moment. All right, it's just a little bit after 4 p.m. I'm sorry, 4 a.m. And I'm just pulling into uh, Walt Disney World. Um, from the reports I've seen on Facebook, uh, it seems that uh, the, um, the security uh, checkpoint for the bag check is already completely packed full. So uh, I don't know uh, my chances of getting in here in a timely fashion. All right, not bad. Uh, again, uh, just a little after four, it's almost actually 4.20. Uh, and uh, we're just pulling up right now. Got the security doggo out today. And here's the new bag check. Alright, so I was just given this commemorative map for uh, Galaxy's Edge. Oh, what's going on? Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to your Hollywood adventure where we invite you to dream, wonder, and imagine. Alright, so here we are, the Force Mood Indoor where Star Tours was. My favorite uh, pub slash uh, beer uh, garden over here, Vaseline. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Got myself another commemorative uh, traveler's guide. So it seems like this uh, Los Angeles tunnel is taking us directly to another world. Holy jeez. Wow, we're already in here. So over here, this would be the entrance to uh, Rise of Resistance. Oh wow, look at this. This is the line already. Everyone here waiting to get on. Smugglers run. All right, so from what I've been told, this line is five hours long. See more of these beautiful rocks up here. Well, 
So who's that fella on your shoulder? So, say again? Who's the little fella on your shoulder? So this is Simon. He's a Kowakian monkey lizard. They're reptile mammals indigenous off the planet Kowak. They are energetic. They love attention and can be a bit mischievous. But believe it when I say, once you bond, they are friends for life. These guys on their home planet, they'll nap up little insects, grab small reptiles, even small mammals. They leave food out. And probably not going to be there for very long. <laughs> But our friend over here has been very well behaved with it. Oh, I think this over here is the creature shop. Oh, are these the things that are like chasing Han? What is this? The... It's a Rathar. It's a cephalopod. Oh. Who knew? Pardon me, travelers. Pardon me. I need to go my way through here. Thank you. There you go. There's a bantha. Another bantha. Look at this weird frog looking guy. Oh my god, it's tails moving! He's got a little baby pork with him too. That's adorable. Ah, it's Monto Roasters. Look at that. Wow. Now that's a pod racing uh, engine. Like someone's being interviewed over there for a commercial or some sort of uh, promotional uh, video. Exactly what you guys were. Okay, I found it. There you go. There is Oga's Cantina. And of course, there's a line. I oh, it's nice they provided us with a water station over here. And further here, this is still the line just to get in the container, I think. This is Kylo Ren's ship. Will he see? Will we see him? I don't know. Probably not anytime soon. But yeah, this is where the first order is set shop. Like right here is the exit to Droid Depot. And as you can see over here, there's a whole bunch of uh, droids. 
ready to be serviced, clean. This looks like some sort of weird power station over here. Did I circle around? How did that happen? All right, so I was just circling back from Ronto Roasters. I'm gonna make my way back down here because that over there is going back to the Millennium Falcon. All right, been here for only about an hour and I am already sweltering. I need to get myself some water. Oh. Thank you. Got it? Is anything coming out? Nah, it's probably empty. <laughs> no wonder no one's here. <laughs> so yeah, apparently the water is out, uh, which is uh, kind of a bummer. Uh, but whatever, I've got a water bottle on my pack. Uh, everything's all good for now. I've been all over Black Spire Outpost already, and this is like the only first place that's water and a water filling station right over here. All right, here we go. I'm gonna fill up my, my cup right over there. Fill out with some water. All right, uh, so I just left Galaxy's Edge. For the time being, granted, I've uh, joined a boarding pass. Uh, or boarding group, uh, which says uh, it's going to be in the late morning. Uh, I was told late morning could be from uh, 10 to noon. Uh, but while I'm out here, you know, it's not its not even 7, was it 7 o'clock? No, it's only 6.49 right now. Uh, I figured, you know what, I'm going to take advantage of this and try to ride uh, Tower of Terror a couple of times, uh, as well as Aerosmith uh, Rock and Roller Coaster uh, before I get back into uh, Galaxy's Edge.